Hello guys, this is Lee. We're uh, here at Bass Pro Shop. It is uh, Black Friday 2022. And we're right where our numbers are. We got 172, 171, 231. And I got 232. Right there we are, Bass Pro Shop. All right, more to come. All right, guys, it's Lee, Keith, and Zach. Stop. We uh, just picked up a mower. Shop Springs Creamery. Shop Springs Creamery. <laughs> it's like near Watertown, Tennessee. So let's show you what we got today. All right, guys, it's Lee. It is a couple days later. You know, that last clip was Black Friday. We went and picked up this mower. And um, so I'm gonna show you about it a little bit. If you like these, like if you like the video, subscribe to this channel. <laughs> That's not too good. So I just got it off the trailer, basically drove it in here. And then I went back to Thanksgiving activities with the family. But one thing this thing didn't have, and I got it for a little bit cheaper, it didn't even have the breather on it. So I was concerned about that because you know, gotta have a breather. But this is a 14 horse Briggs. And luckily, now this is just pure luck and I really had forgotten about it. <clears throat> but I got a 14 horse Briggs that had some bad valves. You remember seeing that one? Well, that's a 14 horse Briggs. So took the breather off that, I'm gonna move it over. I mean, I could probably park this out and make more money than what I paid for it. You know, I can sell the deck and use that breather and then have to worry about it. So I'm gonna put that breather on here. Anyway, this is it. So I'm gonna pop that on there real quick and be right back. All right, I got that on there, but I didn't want to run it at all without that. I think I got the little screen here and let's see, and I got the little cap that goes over that for safety. But I hadn't really messed with this at all. So I'm just going to um, get it out and show you about, I guess I'll pull it outside and drive it a little bit. But on this, um, the biggest concern I have about it, and I'm just gonna have to get some help working on this probably, or maybe I can figure it out, is the steering is not real strong. It does not turn right very far. And I don't know if it needs to, but I'm gonna just get in there and look at it and see if there's a simple fix. And I've already spoke with um, Hip Daisy, which is our YouTube channel, Hip Daisy. And the guy's name's Fred, but um, he's got Chigger Chomper, which is a big lifted, a lot bigger than this one. <clears throat> and he had a real nice custom steering on it. So I'm trying to steal some ideas from him or he's helping me. Um, so anyway, let's pull it out and see what it looks like.
so there it is. Um, somebody said, Lee, why would you buy that? And I don't know. I don't know why I bought it. It's just something to mess with. Um, I'm not going to get into it right now, but the steering, we're going to work on that coming up. He's got the choke and stuff kind of not right. And since I got a parts mower out here, I might could uh, go back to the original setup on the choke and um, uh, throttle response. So we'll look into that. I mean, it's not bad the way it is. Actually, it runs pretty good. It starts easy. It, it, it really runs good. We got a parade coming up this weekend. And I... I ought to put it in there, but I don't know if I trust it yet. It's hard to tell. But anyway, that's it. I'll show you a couple more pictures of it, and that'll be that. I've got your front bumper here. I'm guessing that it's probably a two-foot lift. I haven't put the tape measure to it, but this bar seems to be about two feet. Um, got a little decoration there it's got lights led lights underneath it can't really see it now got a new battery this is uh you gotta have that switch on all the wiring's kind of jacked up you gotta have a kill wire right here and stuff like that but that has something to do with the lights i don't know it's not bad not bad the way it is but you can see the steering look as far as it goes right there, right? So that's not really acceptable. So we'll have to get into that. That might be the next video. Most likely my next video. Well, I don't know be in my next video, but I'll do a video on the steering once I get it figured out. And then we'll, you know, we'll play around with it for a little while and see what we're going to do with it. But uh, <clears throat> anyway, it is after Thanksgiving. Uh, we had a good Thanksgiving. The girls shopped Friday. We just went to that one place, uh, Bass Pro Shop. They were giving out gift cards. So we did that. And then we, me and Zach come home, and the girls went shopping all day. So that's what we got, went and got that. So anyway, I think I'm out. It's going to be a short video. Oh, let me show you my parade vehicle. I'm working on it. So this is what I know I want to put in the parade. It's the Jeep mower, but I got the trailer, and I got these banners made. And then what I'm going to do is um, I put these nails in. I'm going to hang Christmas wreaths at four corners here and on the front, probably inside here, and on, of course on the front grill. I'll put my umbrellas up. I think gaudier the better on something like this. And uh, so that's to come uh, next week. So that's really all I got for today. I just wanted to get a video out there on that uh, lifted mower. I guess I need to call it something, but I guess it'd be called lifted mower. But anyway, uh, I'm out.